Hi y'all, uh, my name is Chris, and this is my second video uh, for my YouTube channel. Uh, this week is just going to be uh, a little bit of an update on my transition so far. I'm 11 weeks on T, so I just wanted to talk about some of the changes I've experienced. Um, I know a lot of guys do this, but I wanted to just document a little bit of this on video. So, um, in the first 11 weeks, I've noticed a few things uh, at the very beginning. Um, some of the first changes I noticed definitely were my anxiety. I've um, always had bad anxiety, but um, my anxiety was kind of through the roof. A few guys had warned me about that, so I, um, I was a little bit prepared for it. It's still kind of bad, but um, that's something that I already had to deal with a lot. So, Also one of the first changes I noticed was an increase in appetite. I've never been much of an eater. I, am, uh, I have previously suffered uh, from eating disorders, so um, I just have a really weird relationship with food. And being on testosterone has actually been a really good thing for me because it's kind of forced me to um, eat more habitually. So um, that's been good. But that's also meant that I've um, packed on a little bit of weight. Um, I'm not big by any means, but I've never had trouble um, keeping on like any sort of body mass. Um, so I've definitely noticed that I've put on a little bit of weight, probably about 10 pounds. Um, in these first 11 weeks or so. A lot of it has been muscle. Um, I've definitely bulked up um, a lot quicker than I thought would happen. I didn't expect to see this much change in like my body mass in just um, like the first two months or so. But I've definitely broadened out and a lot of people have commented on it. Um, I've noticed an increase of strength at the gym, which is fun, um, especially like doing push-ups and stuff, just things coming a lot easier. Um, my voice has dropped, I think about two separate times I've noticed that it's dropped. It's a little, it, um, I think it's n noticeably different from the way it was before T. So that's good, that's one of the th things I was really looking forward to. I hope it just keeps dropping. Uh, there was a phase there where I was cracking all the time, which was pretty funny. And um, <laughs> I, I just got a kick out of trying to sing <laughs> while it cracked all the time. Um, what else? Um, at the very beginning, one of the first changes I noticed also was bottom growth. I know a lot of people don't really talk a lot about that. Um, it was definitely noticeable and it was really uncomfortable. Um, just super, super sensitive and that was something that I wasn't necessarily prepared for. I was prepared for the growth but not the feeling of it. Um, and that did kind of wear off so that's nice. Um, I have noticed not necessarily, people say that they get like horny all the time, um, I just kind of feel like turned on all the time, so I guess maybe those go hand in hand. Um, it's not necessarily like I'm, uh, I've always had a high sex drive, but now I just kind of constantly feel turned on, so. Um, what else? Um, my face is squared out a little bit, um, and, uh, as far as like body hair and stuff, um, I have like no body hair at all to begin with. So um, I've noticed a little bit here and there, like the tiniest, babyest, happy trail ever. And like a little bit of like baby stubble coming in. Um, but besides that, not much yet that I've noticed. Um, so, so far that's, that's pretty much it. Pretty typical changes. Um, I think that I'll talk about maybe um, self-injecting and um, some shot anxiety stuff next week and then maybe also pair that with talking about how to cope with dysphoria. Um, I also want to talk about uh, passing and not passing soon uh, because I never pass. <laughs> so um, I think that's a good topic to talk about. Um, yeah, so this is just a quick little update. These are some changes that I felt so far. Um, so far it's been pretty good. Uh, I like everything that's happened um, and I feel more confident every single day and I'm really, really grateful for that. So uh, thanks for watching. Feel free to like and comment. Give me any suggestions for future topics. I am open to topic talking about all sorts of things, not just my own personal transition, um, anything. Um, so feel free to give me ideas. Feel free to uh, subscribe and share. And I hope you guys have an awesome week.